What would Good. you like to say to her first? <laughs> About a drinky pooing the other night. So oh, you yeah. was there as well. Yes, a drinky pooing the other night. Yeah, it's birthday a drinky party. Poo. Well, because it was a special occasion, I can understand why she has a drink. But the problem is, as you say, she is such a lightweight. She <laughs> she can't is. lightweight. She's dreadful. <laughs> and <clears throat> the only thing I can say is, the other night we had a party, <laughs> and I thought, oh God, I'll go invite daughter. Do you know what I mean? So she comes along. <laughs> we need to fight. I was on organised yet. No, no, I'm talking about my one. Oh, your, your one. one. Oh, okay. And I, I had a singer there, and that's the worst thing you can do. Because as soon as she knows there's a microphone, oh, no. you know, yeah, she's up there singing. What do you think of her singing? Do you like her singing? She can sing. She can sing, but the only thing is I hate it because she wants to do ballads all the time. Oh, no. And when you've got a party, yeah, you've got you want Whitney it to be Houston swinging. and that's a nightmare. But, as I say, like, she's not bad, you know, the drinky pooing oh, night. No. It's not all the time. Now, I bumped into Katie when we were coming down the corridor this morning and I said, oh, you're looking forward <coughs> to your mum coming on? She went, oh, she's already having a go at me because I've had my lips done again. I can't again. bear it. I call her Daffy Duck. <laughs> <laughs> so, as soon as I saw her this morning, it. she looked at me... And she went, disgusting. I it went, is. what? She said, you've had your lips it's done. It's dreadful. I don't know why she does it to you. Yourself. Have you had them done, done last yesterday? Night, yeah, the last night. I yeah. left her last night and she was fine. This morning, she looks like that. Has <laughs> 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 she ever listened to you when you tell her things that you don't uh, like? Her? No, not really. No. Oh, I do. I do listen. You she... are always right, which I hate. Yeah, but because <laughs> what, what Kate does, she does something <clears throat> and then tells me after. Because if she tells me that she's doing something, then, uh, because I have a relative and tell her off... She I'm doesn't dying like to know off. about the topless bit. Did she tell yeah. you in advance that you were going to go topless? Well, that's another story. That Ooh. is. No, no, no. <laughs> I'll tell you what happened. By the way, I did tell them how intelligent you were until I got you to look after Har Harvey. Well, do you think I wasn't intelligent when I looked after Harvey, then? <laughs> well, well, you know, I'm okay, so you're the topless bit here. <laughs> yeah, go on, yeah. it's yeah. no, no, the bit. In your office in London. <laughs> yeah, I was working in London and... I'll be honest, Kate always wanted to do modelling. And when she was younger, I, I took her to the model agencies in London and they said, get your GCSEs, come back, because you, you've got to have an education because it, if you don't make yeah. it. Good and advice. and uh, so she did that. But when we took her back, they've gone, I'm sorry, you're too short. But we, could use, yeah, yes. cat walk. we could use your hair, your face, your hands, your feet, your body, but not all of you as a model. Anyway, she accepted it. Uh, went back to uh, doing uh, work. I think you're doing nothing, then, weren't you? Or looking yeah. after older people. Yeah. And uh, someone took a picture of her and sent it up to this glamour agency. And uh... cut, let me cut the long story short because you're babbling. Just <laughs> basically, <laughs> I, ended up, I ended up on page three. And how did you find out I was topless? Absolutely disgusting. Yeah, but how did you find out? <laughs> well, <laughs> what happened? She rang Hurry me up, up and she said, uh, <laughs> I'm doing, I'm doing um, page three. I said, whatever you do, you do not get your boobies out. You keep covered. And she said, no, no, it'd be all right, be all right. Anyway, then she rung me. She said, I went it for four days, gradually doing the strip bit. Oh, you went mental. <laughs> My son was, what, did a disown her? Yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? It was oh, wow. awful. And then I went to work and there she is as a screensaver. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> it was awful. Oh, so that's the first you saw you were walking past someone's desk and there she yeah, was yeah, on Yeah, yeah, there she computer. was like that. Like, yeah. And like, were you ashamed? Was that the feeling? I didn't know where to put my face. Is that when you were working for Margaret Thatcher? Didn't you work for Margaret Thatcher? No, th what that was all about was I used to do the speeches when there was, um, oh, you know, when they do the... Um, conferences. The things. conferences. Yes. I used to go down there and, like, type up all the speeches and, like... And then when they read them, you have to go back to do it before it's released to the press. Right. That oh. kind of thing. And I did clinics. But then you, like But then you gave that up to help Katie look after Harvey. Yeah, I was working in London after that. Yeah. And then, yeah... Because of when Harvey come along, she, she couldn't cope on her own. Cause it but was we ridiculous. always say, Amy, and I know I've said this when Katie's here. I've said it in interviews. She is the most incredible mother with, yeah, she's with good. Harvey. Yeah. I mean, with all of them. For you to watch her going through that on her own. Well, it was ridiculous because. Well, you was with me when they said that Harvey was blind. <laughs> yeah, remember? Was, and we were like, what? It was such a bizarre moment because. The doctor that um, we had, he's like a family friend, really, wasn't he? And he said, you know what, Kate, he can't see, he is blind. And we looked at each other and we, we never cried. Mm. We just thought, right, so what are we going to do now then? 
you know, how are we going to... on with it. We've yeah. got to do with, deal with this. And, that, and then we sort of thought, right, we're going to get expert opinions on it. And then one doctor said, no, he's never, ever going to see. Then we actually went up to Moorfields and they said, we actually can see something. And that little bit gave us hope. And they mm. told us how to develop these eyes, what sight he had, like with CDs, mm. under, um, like, blackout curtains and that. Do you remember? But mm -hmm. between the two of you, I mean, you love him to pieces. You yeah, know, you wonderful. give him such a happy life. You've seen Katie actually with Harvey, have you? And you manage him so mm. well. Mm. Yeah. It's amazing so to watch huge. you. huge. While your mum's really here, and work. I know you said you're, you're very like the two of you, which I know makes you argue sometimes, and there's a lot yeah, of banter. but I'm the funniest one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, what would you like to say to your mum? You know, it's Mother's Day on Sunday, and we don't she tell our mums... She knows I love her to bits. Do you? You know I do, you egg. <laughs> she you dressed know you I today, do. Didn't oh, she? look at her crying. You're such a softie. <laughs> but she knows I do.